Okay. Let me have Brian and Eamon O'Sullivan. And Brian and Eamon O'Sullivan started off with that. It's the Dryad Seagrass Stool Craft Kit. Okay? Brian and Eamon. Brian and Eamon. This is Brian. And that's Eamon. How old are you, Brian? I'm, I'm eight years old. And how old are you? How, how old Eleven. Are you? Eleven. And where are you both from? Kenmare. Uh, Two Sist, Kenmare, County Kerry. Two Sist, Kenmare, County Kerry. I see. So this is a parish outside Kenmare. It is, yes. Does he boss you around? Sometimes. <laughs> Does he tell you what to do? Yeah. Yeah. What do you say in, in return? Do you always do what he says? S sometimes. Sometimes, I see. I see. I see. And your daddy is in football, is he? Yes. Yes? What does he train? Tell them. The Kerry team. He trains the Kerry team. His daddy, tra their daddy trains the Kerry team. Yeah. Are you two on the team? No. No. You're going to be? Hopefully. 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 Oh, yeah, I'll bet you will. I'll bet you will use it. All right, then. OK, this is your stool craft kit. It came. Let me show you what it came with. It comes with, it comes like so. That's what you get. You get the rope and you get the wood and you get a sort of a needle type thing for lacing it all together and then you set to work. Very difficult, I would have thought. How about that for a finished object? How about that? They made that themselves. Out of this. Right. Look at that. So who did most of the work then? Half and half. Half and half. Always half and half, is it? Yes. Okay. So what was the difficult part then? The weaving the, was the weaving most difficult. The weaving was the hardest. The weaving. Why was the weaving the hardest? Well, because the instructions weren't that were they weren't good. They weren't. They were a bit difficult. To why, why weren't they good? Were, were, were they confusing? Yes. I see. What, why do you, you have to you have to attach the rope to the, that? Do the, you? The rope. You bring it through and yeah. then bend it and pull it down into the narrow part and then yeah. it stays attached. To and the then you have to go over and, and over and back. Yes. Well, at the start, we you just weave that around normally, that piece there, mm. and then you weave in the pattern on this side. Mm. And you have to do, do you have to do the individual rope, Individual rope on Each the second, individual yes, one. yes. Each one? Each one. Very, very long, very time consuming. Yeah, how long did it take you to do all this? Roughly yeah. four hours altogether, yeah. if you, because we did it over different nights. And I see, I see. And then how do you put the, 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 the legs and the, and the bracers together? First we put them together and then we took it apart and then we put, <laughs> put it together. Why did you put it together and then take it apart? To, to see how we do it, to see how we'd make it. Is that true, Ellie? Just to put it together and see uh, the pieces, the, the bottom pieces and top pieces, just to put it together mm. and see if, just see what it looks like mm. at the start. And that's tongue and groove, is it? Tongue and groove. Yeah, and then do they supply the glue? Yeah, they, yeah. yes, they supplied the glue. Yeah. Do, you varnished it, did you? We varnished it. They didn't supply the varnish and we had the sandpaper and they didn't supply the sandpaper. I see. You varnished it once, then sandpaper, then, then varnished it. Yeah. That's sandpapers. the right way to do it, right enough, yes. And, and did you get confused about this part of it here, the under part, where you're confused? Yes, about? it says in the instructions to finish off by weaving the rest of the rope in along the bottom. Yeah. And we actually thought that uh, you were supposed to do the whole thing over again. Yes, like the top. Until uh, the li and there was not enough string. I see. So then we walked along and we found a shop with one of those tools in it and we looked underneath into the sea. <laughs> <laughs> and, you, and you saw that's the way and they did it? We saw that's the way. And did nobody help you? Did your mum help you or your well, dad? Well, she helped she us with the instructions. instructions. Oh, she read the instructions. Well, that's a great help. If somebody yeah. reads, stands there with the leaflet and reads the instructions, that's easier, I see. OK, so out of ten, then, what would you give it? Seven. 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 <laughs> Are we giving this thing seven or eight? Seven. 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 Well done, Brian. Stick to your guns. That's the boy. Why are you taking three marks off? Because well, the instructions were a bit difficult to follow. Right. They didn't supply sandpaper and right. they didn't supply varnish. 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 And, and no varnish brush. No varnish So brush. three marks off for three that. Three marks off for Okay, that. but you did very well, fellas. Thank you very much indeed. They're, they're the good boys. Well done. Eamon and Brian, there you go. Thank you. Eamon and Brian, thank you very much indeed. Off you go. Over that way. Thank you. Very good. That's Eamon and Brian. Bye, boys.